is it possible to buy a single gherkin? No. Shame. Hello, Dirk, Dirk, gently. Hello. Can I help you? Oh, yes, please. I'm starving. What would you recommend? Combination of battered fish and fried potatoes would be traditional. Cod and chips? Wait, paddock chips. Can't miss out on place. Do you know they can live until they're 50? No. Right, which one will it be? All of them. And mushy peas and curry sauce. That's it. Except for uh, Savaloy. So, I know what holistic therapy is and holistic education and holistic medicine, but what is a holistic detective? Uh, well, uh, quantum mechanics suggests Everything that is interconnected. Well, yeah, indeed so. By following any one causal thread, however tangential it may appear, you will ultimately and inevitably arrive at the solution to the crime. Right, if you already knew... Sorry. I think faster than I can speak, so I'm always answering my own questions. It's exhausting for me. It must be profoundly annoying for everyone else. It's brilliant, by the way. A holistic detective agency. The whole thing. You. You're brilliant. Cotton chips, haddocken chips, place and chips, mushy peas, curry sauce, and one saveloy. That's 29 pounds and 30 pence, please. Oh, I don't have any money. What? But I could write you an IOU. You take the piss. What do you do in these situations? I'm a firm believer that the proprietor of a chip shop will have eaten far too many chips, thus hindering his athletic prowess. What are you saying? In layman's terms, what I'm saying is... Run. Yeah. Hey! Uh, come out! So, why were you expelled? If you don't mind me asking. I suffer from a very rare condition known as narcoleptic clairvoyance. You predict the future when you're asleep. Exactly so, yeah. My roommate told me I was predicting exam papers while I was asleep. Not surprisingly, I was offered some pretty hefty bribes by a pretty hefty number of people to let them see the predictions. I was young and rash and had developed a taste for fine wines and dining that far exceeded my student grant. Is this fine dining? Yes, yes indeed. Trouble was, the exam papers I predicted bore no relation to the real ones, except for one, applied quantum physics. It was the same as the one set, exactly the same, word for word, to the comma. Coincidence can be a brutal thing. Professor Jericho is the only one who believed I didn't cheat. Or so he said. Sorry. That was a bit presumptuous, wasn't it? They don't get out much. Well, in my experience, while it's almost never acceptable for a man to surprise a woman with a kiss, men rarely raise objections when women do the same to them, as is the case in this instance. These are very good chips. 